Hello viewers, I'm going to be giving you guys five tips that you might not know about in Gloria Victus. Alright, so first, we're going to start off with the hunger bar, okay? So at the top left of your screen here, you're going to have a hunger bar, alright? Basically, you need to eat food so that you're not hungry anymore. Pretty simple, right? And depending on which kind of food you eat, you will actually gain better effects based off of your hunger. So if you want to take the time, you can read this, but there's a little tip right there. Tip number two is going to be the arena practice. Now, you might not be that good at combat, right? You want to get some practice in. All you have to do is hold Alt or whichever key to open your mouse and go to the top right of your screen and you want to go to the arena. So once you've entered the arena, it's just a big practice arena, okay? They got a couple dummies over here, some archery. But if you run this way, right, there's going to be a couple mobs over here that you can fight, right? And you can skip these guys, okay? You can practice with the that ballista right there. But these are the three guys right here that I want to talk about, okay? So these are your combat teachers. Obviously, the higher level ones are going to be harder. So all I gotta do is walk up and just tag them, and you can practice uh, carrying like this. You can practice chambering, whatever you want. It doesn't matter. It's gonna help you be get a better player, and you're not gonna have to worry about losing your stuff or having to requeue or anything like that, because you can just infinitely do this and just practice, 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 practice. If you want to leave the arena, all you have to do. It's the same thing, but return to the world map. Tip number three is going to be about crafting. All right. So when you're on a workshop and you click on an item, you need to make sure that there's a green arrow in this area and also a green symbol as well. Okay. This is going to allow you to create more items and you'll actually get more experience for crafting it and more character experience as well if you use the right machine for the right job. Okay, just look for the green arrow and you'll know if you're at the right station or not. Tip number four, daily challenges. All you want to do is press H on your keyboard or whichever keybind you have and you need to go to the achievements. All right. On the left, there's going to be your daily challenges. They're going to be locked until you hit level 50. But this is an easy way to earn some extra coins and passive experience, right? So you got your active challenges. They reset every 24 hours. Once you complete 12 of them, you'll unlock all these little milestone chests along the way. All right? So all I have to do is click the plus sign. And you can click any of these challenges that you want to play. And all you got to do is complete them just for playing the game. You get extra experience, coins, whatever. Right, so pick this one. You got to get 80 wood logs. All right, this one. You got to ride on your mount. That's all you got to do. You can literally get free experience for riding around, which you're going to do anyways. All right, final tip is going to be your shop. Okay, your little market stall. Press F3. You're going to get this little interaction menu here, right? So you could basically drag any items that you want that you want to sell, of course. So let's say I want to sell this. You can enter in whatever you want to sell them for. Okay. The amount, item limit, whatever. Then you click sell. And then what you want to do is activate the stall. You can even sell horses, right? You just click on the horse. You can click the horse that you want to sell. Put it in the stall. Somebody can buy it. Once you got all your items in here, activate the stall gonna say do you not want to be able to move pretty much click OK boom you got your stall set up now any player in the game can come up here and buy your items so that's gonna be all the tips for today I'll probably come out with some more uh, I hope this video is short and informative for you and I appreciate you guys watching see ya